What's going on, my beautiful people? In today's Madden 22 video, I'm going to be giving you guys an easy and simple, unblockable Madden 22 blitz. If you're new to the channel, drop a thumbs up on the video. Hit that red subscribe button for more tips and tricks like these. Also, thank you guys for 11 thousand subscribers i did give away some gift cards i appreciate everybody that came to the screen the link in the description has everything that you need i updated the patreon and the ebooks so if you want the entire scheme of this blitz go in the link in the description without any further ado let's get into the blitz breakdown this is your one stop shop for all Madden needs. Whether you're looking for some fly merchandise, you're looking for ebooks, you're looking for a Patreon membership, or you just want to become part of the Tutty Squad. I appreciate all the love and support. Everything is in the link in the description. Let's get it. All right, so the main play is going to be the Slant Zone 2. I like to mix that in in my audibles with Cover 3 Bluff and then Cover 6 Show 2. Them three plays is going to give you all the weapons you need on defense to lock any type of formation down. Whether it's gun trips, whether it's gun bunch, gun tight offset, block the running back, not block the running back. This scheme will lock up your opponent. Okay, so you can also shoot the gap on the run play out of the dime two, three, six contain the escape artist quarterback and everything in between so how do you set up the dime 236 out of the ravens playbook let's get into it so the play is going to look like this by default so it's best if you have auto base align set so go to your coach adjustments make that adjustment first okay so you will be looking like this then you want to spread your linebackers okay so once you spread your linebackers the play is going to be looking like this so spreading your linebackers is going to be right on the d-pad and then left stick up is spread okay so from there only thing you want to do is push r1 or rb two times that's going to contain then you make adjustments behind it what i like to do is push right d-pad two times go to my a icon and then i will man him up with somebody on the right side of the field or I will put him into a spy, okay? So this is how it's looking right now. Now, I will hold left trigger, and in two and a half seconds, somebody will come in free. So one, two, we're gonna drop out here into coverage. Somebody's gonna come around free, whether the running back stays in or whether the running back is blocking. So we're gonna look at this real quick. I have a full scheme in the ebook updated today and on the Patreon for the cover three, the cover six and all the adjustments you can make on cover two you can also do cover two with a cover three shell so once we hike the ball and i stand still as you can see a looper comes around completely untouched now you can also do a cover three shell out of the cover two and all that is broke down on my patreon and in the ebooks so the sidelines are better covered in practice mode you can't do zone drop so i'm gonna go through a few different setups so if you want to be default for your blues make sure that you are taking short dump offs from the running back and the tight end so if we set it up so if we set the play up what they can hit you with is a quick throw to the running back or a quick throw to the tight end so if we went like this and we took that tight end away the only thing that would be available would be the running back and you can take that away by pushing left d-pad two times and bluff blitzing x okay so if you put him in a bluff blitz it would be the same result so he comes out boom i stand right here and now i pick up some routes and you're either going to get a looping blitz or a disengage super super fast this entire defense is going to always get pressure in two and a half to three seconds so if we set it up you're going to spread your linebackers you're going to come right here you can bluff blitz him and then guest pad practice 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 the setups until you get good so you come one two drop underneath here in coverage you can see the bluff blitz stays down there where the running back is at 
I drop for the verticals if he tries to step into the throw and I have a safety right there and I'm close enough, I could jump up for an easy interception. So I stay right here. If he tries to throw this, he's going to have to lob it. So I have two people right there who can break on that ball. You can come down there and bring them in there. And we always got at least one person disengaging or somebody coming free. As you can see, like I said, the bluff blitz stay right there. This is only a four man blitz now. He takes the running back. The blitzer is coming around. The contain is on. If he tries to step up in the pocket, he's going to run into number 11 Parsons. If he tries to get to the outside, he's going to run into the contain. Everything goes is nicely guarded down the field. Use this on third and fourth down to get a lot of sex crucial stops if you want the full scheme where i go over all the adjustments in running cover three mixing that in giving him different looks bluffing the blitz with a three man four man all that is in the link in the description go win you some games